Hey everyone, this is Mastermind278 here once again with the HP Touchpad. Uh, at this video, I'm going to show you guys how to install Google Apps for the HP Touchpad on Cyanogen Mod 7.1. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is actually go back to our computer and we're actually going to go to the Google Apps uh, section of the Cyanogen Mod website and we're going to find uh, Google. Sanogen mod there 7 and then it has the download link here to download these apps so I'm just going to quickly download these alrighty so those are downloaded and here's the files the file I should say and that's the, our Google Apps uh, file at this point I am going to go to the HP touchpad and we're going to plug in the USB. Alrighty. So we plugged in our USB. And at this point, I'm going to press the power button. Oh, power button. And I will choose reboot. And I'm going to choose recovery. Then click OK. You can also do this when you start up the HP touchpad with the Mo boot. You're able to choose uh, the Cyanogen uh, clock mod work recovery. But since we already had our touchpad booted up, we're just going to go this way. Alrighty. See, it's loading cloud mod work, clock mod works. All right, so at this point, we are at the recovery screen here, and we can navigate using our volume up and volume down buttons up here. So, I'm actually going to go to install zip from SD card and then press the home button right there. And then it's going to choose you, choose it from SD. The thing you must remember is we still haven't put it on our HP touchpad. So I'm actually going to go back here. I'm going to go to mount and storage. Choose that. And then I'm going to mount USB storage. And what this will do is we'll go back to my computer here. I'm going to go to computer here. It's going to mount pretty much the, um, the memory of the HP touchpad. And at this point, I'm just going to drag over the Google Apps file right into the folder here on the main directory. All right, so it's copied over. I'm just going to go back to removable disk, computer, and then we're just going to eject it real quick. There we go. Alrighty. So now we're going back to the HP touchpad. And we are going to, since it's already on highlighted under unmount, we're just going to press the home button there. And then I'm just going to scroll down to go back again. And now I'm going to go to install zip from SD card. Choose that. Choose zip from SD card. And then I'm going to go all the way to the bottom, choose the G apps, uh, GB, gingerbread, and press the OK. You've got to scroll down to yes, I want to install this. And we are installing Google Apps. Installation is complete. And now we're back up here. We can see uh, what's going on. So I'm just going to choose go back and reboot system now. Alright, so it's going to automatically do Cyanogen your mod, but I'll just press the button there, go a little quicker, and now we are booting.
it's usually a lot quicker to boot but as you can see we are loading up brand new apps so you got your backup restore finish setup and now welcome to HP touchpad touch the little Android you can sign in create an account or we can just skip this for now I'm just gonna click next for the time being I'm just gonna skip it for now and next there and here we go we're back on our Android here and if we go to here we should be able to see Google Talk is right there so if we connect to um, Wi-Fi we should be able to get the Google Market once again working and let's do that real quick turn on Wi-Fi and we're back. I apologize for that. I am having some connecting to Wi-Fi issues. I am not sure if it's just my router or if there is just a general uh, connecting to Wi-Fi issue with uh, this ROM. The thing I want to show from here actually, not really to Sandage and Mod Apps, is that I am actually able to connect to an ad hoc network. Um, let's turn that on real quick. And if we scan uh, mastermind Android that's actually an ad hoc network so that's actually nice that we can do that anyway so now that we're actually connected to Wi-Fi I'd like to show you guys uh, how we have the market there you do need to be connected and there we go it needs to ask us to log in let's log in real quick I'll be right back log in real quick here and uh, show you guys that Google Apps does work fine once you're actually connected to Wi-Fi alrighty okay uh, this program will only appear once this is basically gonna let you choose which uh, apps you want to actually download. I'm just going to click OK and zoom out from here and we accept our terms and conditions and pretty much here we show shows up all the Google apps that are available from Google. I'm just going to download Gmail to begin with. Click install, accept and download and we are downloading a little slow to download unfortunately I don't but we are downloading which is great and now we are installing and we have installed Gmail and basically now it's actually gonna wait to sync and we probably have to set up that but so we are able to download from the market let's try something else uh, yeah, so it's actually now gonna sync with uh, my Google account that actually may take a while since I have a bunch of Google devices but let's go to apps let's see let's try a game real quick here And I'm uh, not feeling any of these. Let's go back right there. Now uh, we can try Angry Birds, I guess. Angry Birds. Uh, free. Download. Accept and download. And we are downloading that real quickly here. Let's, so let's see how that works
Yeah, I, my internet is running a little slow today and I'm not really sure but we are also syncing as you can see right there we have the sync icon so we are syncing my Google account with the HP touchpad so that is using up some of the web speed there alright installing We're still installing here. All right, let's click open now. Let's see. All right. As you can see, Angry Birds is running right. We'll just shoot out. We'll do a pinch to zoom test on it also. So, as you can see, actually, uh, my Google account has not actually synced in. So let's press that. And pinch to zoom works. And as you can see, Angry Birds does work just fine on the HP touchpad. Alright, so that's uh, pretty much showing you guys that we do have the Google Market. We have uh, GTalk now available. Um, so we're actually able to have Google Talk also working here. Um, yeah, so that was pretty much how to install Google Apps so you, you have access to the market and are able to actually download apps. Thank you.